So for those of you that have a copy of my album, The Little Ginger and Me Loves The Little Ginger and You, inside there's directions on how to pick up gingers. Now I need these because I can't always pick up people without them. But this is a trick that works. So you might have done these when you were a little kid. Looks like this when you get inside my album and you've got a postcard too so you can even send it to someone with a creep little message. But for now, we're just going to pick some up. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to fold things like it's a big triangle. So what we've got here, we've got two folds, one on either side. This is all made up for you so all you have to do, really do is follow the lines. And I'm going to fold in as well. Just going this way. And then back along this way. There we go. What we're going to do is go in and fold the little rook heads just in like that. You guys might have seen these. You used to play these when you were a kid. They tell you your fortunes, those sorts of things. This one tells you how likely you are going to be the score, which is good. Everybody likes to know these things. All right, so we're going to fold these in, just going in like this. It's much easier to do when you don't have fake nails, but I've just done a video shoot and you can't play music with real nails. So they're going to take the video. All right, so we fold them in like that. All right, so for this, you're just going to push it in like this. It takes a little while because it's a bit smaller to get it to sort of go in the right way. But we're going to make an attempt here. Um, and that's my little game for the album. Little Ginger and Me loves a little ginger and you.